revelations of Jesus, illuminating the enigma of Satan's role delves into the profound insights Jesus suffered about Satan, the personification of evil, and the cosmic struggle between good and evil. Through parables and teachings, Jesus unveils the reality of an adversary actively working against God's redemptive plan. The Parable of the Weeds Jesus introduces Satan as the enemy who plants weeds among the wheat symbolizing the infiltration of evil into God's kingdom. This narrative highlights the coexistence of good and evil and the eventual cosmic drama of their separation at the harvest. Jesus is seen as the archetypal enemy orchestrating an assault on heaven is significant. Jesus further elaborates on this theme in the harvest of the world narrative. He describes the Son of Man as a divine farmer who plants seeds, symbolizing the kingdom's people, the weeds representing those under the evil one's influence, face the fiery destiny. Jesus is this imagery to underscore the ultimate confrontation between good and evil. Casting Satan is the discord sower in humanity. In Jordan's Gospel, Jesus identifies Satan as the evil one with power over the world. However, believers as beacons of God's light were partaken from Satan's influence. This distinction between the world of the Satan and those born of God who find divine protection is critical. Apostle John echoes Jesus, but teachings in his letters, affirming that those born of God are shielded from Satan's touch. This spiritual lineage creates a barrier against the adverse of their schemes. These e sites reveal the existence of an adversary, but also assure his eventual defeat in the grand scheme of redemption. Jesus Teachings offer deep insights into the dynamics between divine and diabolical forces, revealing the reality of spiritual warfare. He addresses different spiritual maturity levels in John's epistle, acknowledging the unique journey as a father, Jalian, and children in faith. In the prophetic context of his sacrifice, Jesus declares the judgment of the prince of this world and his impending defeat at Calvary. The crucifixion, though appearing as a triumph for Satan, paradoxically marks his ultimate undoing, a shift in the cosmic order. Jesus also speaks of the world under Satan's dominion, highlighting his rule over a surward world. It, in his imminent confrontation with betrayal, Jesus asserts his immunity to Satan's claim, providing hope for believers amid spiritual warfare. The scriptures all reveal a cosmic rebellion against God's divine order, rooted in Satan's ambition. This defines the casting when God's established divine order. Believers face assaults from a world under Satan's rule, as Jesus enables Satan the Father of Lies. The words and ideologies, education, and commerce influenced by Saint Tulletin, the Apostle John warns against loving the world as it leads away from God. His story highlights Satan's targeted attacks on God's faithful. Jesus fought his Peter sifting by Satan, a test of faith under divine authority. His story provides insight into the cosmic struggle, assuring believers of divine control over Satan's actions. Jesus unraveled the mysteries of the unseen realm, shedding light on the cosmic chessboard of spiritual warfare. Satan, the adversary and accuser, seeks to test and tempt believers. As seen John's story in the celestial court, seen with Joshua the high priest. Peter's warnings about the devil's relentless pursuit, likened to a roaring lion, emphasize the need for vigilance. The metaphor of sifting wheat illustrates Satan's intent to destroy believers' faith. The Jesus as the intermediator assures believers of their faithful's resilience. 
The crystal life, likened to a refining process, molds character and transforms believers into Christ's reflections. James encourages embracing trials as they lead to endurance and perfection in faith. Jesus assures that believers that tested with will not succumb permanently. The trials face serve a purpose in God's plan, strengthening faith and enabling believers to assist others in their spiritual journeys. Crossed into Sishimo of his role as an eternal inter, lectures believers of detection against Satan's pursuits. The narrative of Peter's denial and subsequent restoration highlights the power of trials for growth and the ability to comfort others. Satan's attempts to sift believers like wheat are countered by Christ's protective intercession. Jesus yet prayer in John 17 seeks divine protection for his followers, ensuring their safeguarding from the adversary. The Good Shepherd metaphor in John Tain assures believers of eternal security and protection from external forces. Christ's unchanging intercession is emphasized in Philippians 1 verse 6, ensures the completion of the work begun believers. Navigating the cosmic chessboard of spiritual warfare, believers find strength in Christ's intercession. Trials, while challenging, serve to refine and strengthen faith, leading to ultimate victory through life's spiritual battles. Peter's story of denial, characterized by overconfidence in subsequent humanity, illustrates the delicate dance in the spiritual journey. Satan's goal to weaken faith is counted by Christ's intercession, which preserves and strengthens believers. In the face of spiritual warfare, believers are reassured by the unchanging nature of Christ's intercession. The trials faced are not arbitrary, but part of God's divine plan, offering opportunities for growth and transformation. The triumph in the crucible of life was marked by Christ's intercession, a testament to the enduring strength of faith in the face of adversity. Believers emerge from trials fortified, ready to uplift and strengthen others in their faith journeys. Navigating the spiritual terrain, believers encounter trials and tribulations at the shield of faith. Strengthened by Christ's intercession offers protection and assurance. The promise of God's unwavering support ensures that faith triumphs over adversity. Peter's journey marked by denial and restoration demonstrates the transformative power of trials. The narrative serves as a reminder of the necessity of humility and reliance on God's strength. True faith shines in repentance or resilience, strengthened by Christ's adequacy. In the cosmic chessboard of spiritual warfare, believers find assurance in the protective hand of God safeguarding their faith from the enemy's schemes. A journey through trials becomes a triumph, a testament to the enduring strength of Christ in overcoming adversity.